yeah, it was brilliant to be back. Um, you know, it, it wasn't ideal that we couldn't play the Bath game, but uh, the club turned uh, you know, the fact that we couldn't play into a massive positive. Great to have a few thousand supporters back and actually very emotional for everybody when we ran out onto the pitch uh, and, and hearing Munster and, and stand up and fight and very grateful for the fans to be to be back um, and then from a performance point of the field, obviously we, we played a, a training game against each other. Uh, great to have the French brothers out, the, the Flannelly brothers, uh, a whole host of under 20 lads um, and then uh, great to see some some uh, old warriors onto the pitch, so very good mix. Obviously only the start of the season but uh, a very positive day for Munster Rugby. Uh, all credit to our, our athletic performance team and, and our medical team that, that got him to, to this point. Uh, we've had some really competitive training and uh, you know, credit to Bath that, uh, that told us uh, uh, already uh, about 10 days ago that the game wouldn't take place. So, like we said earlier, turn it in a, in a real competitive game. It's never ideal to, to play yourself, but uh, from a squad perspective, we, we had a bit of crack on Monday in terms of uh, choosing the, the change rooms for red and grey. And uh, everybody bought into it and, uh, like I said, a real positive day. Uh, Ron was uh, very, very sharp uh, in the first half. He, he, he only played the, the first 30 minutes, so, so really glad for him. He's a, a real bunch of energy and look e easier to, to improve and yeah, great to have Zeebs back and uh, some lovely moments of that uh, first try of them all there. Um, he's just a class rugby player and great to have him as part of the squad. The, some, some class rugby, obviously the conditions help uh, uh, at, at Thurman Park today. The fact that you know both teams knew what 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 each other was going to do, uh, still scoring some very good tries, um, you know that that's a real positive. And then some individual performances, uh, I thought um, you know somebody like Liam Coombs at, at 13 played really well. Somebody like Jack Daly, and then a lot of guys that um, you know came from from kind of nowhere. John Ford uh, starting on the blind side, I, I thought did pretty well. And look, it's it's a real squad effort. Um, you know, there's about 20 to 25 guys that that even didn't even play today so uh, you know we, we're building some good depth but uh, look good training exercise great occasion on the day and great to have the season started now and uh, you know big big step up in intensity next week against Exeter. Uh, looking like it might be a full house uh, down in, in Devon and uh, you know they they are one of the very best teams and uh, it, it's a warm-up it's a warm-up game but you know, that's a club that we as Munster respect and uh, we've had some Fascinating battles with them, uh, obviously a few years ago in, in Cork in a, in a warm-up game and then the two games, the 10-all draw at Sandy Park and I think it was 7-6 at Thurman Park. So incredible respect for them and uh, you know we'll treat it as still a warm-up game but really excited to, to lift the intensity now. Coming in, I, I wasn't sure how it was going to pan out but uh, it turned out to be like a proper game which is good. I think the the crowd definitely made a made a difference. Uh, the intensity was up a bit, and the lads were really up for it after a bit of a long preseason, training hard and everything. So uh, yeah, it's good to get a good blowout. The structure game, and then like playing the the GA sort of style. So uh, it's good it's good to get that that got that going. Um, summer summer rugby, I suppose, it was good crack. Yourself and uh, Jake seem to work really well together. Uh, yeah, well, we've been training we've trained together all week. Like they obviously uh, to practice for the game, they put us together. So yeah, yeah work pretty well with him. He's got a good, good communicator, so it's easy to play with him. Over to Exeter then next week, so an, another chance hopefully for yourself to, to put a, a stake on that nine jersey. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, hopefully, well, yeah, I have to get picked first, but then, uh, yeah, I'd love to play uh, full house over there, I'm pretty sure. So, uh, yeah, full strength Exeter team would be a good challenge.